Hello and welcome to this film which is all about the precipitation reactions practical. Now there's actually four sets of tests to do in this practical but I'm just going to talk you through one of them. They all work in the same way. They've all got two mystery substances to test. I've actually got C and D. And the other pairs of substances are A and B and E and F and G and H and each of those pairs of substances has a different solution to test it with. C and D actually come with barium chloride, but you can see what the other solutions are when you, um, when you have a look at your prac book. So as I say, it's a very, very simple experiment to set up. And basically, each of the sets of tests involves putting just a few drops of each of these liquids into a test tube. So take a few drops of substance D, put it into one test tube. These are these kind of mini test tubes that we're using. Okay, so a few drops is actually looks like quite a lot in the tube. Okay, and then take a few drops of your other substance that you're testing. So in this case, I've got C, and I'm going to put a few drops of that into a different test tube now. Okay, now be really, really careful where you put your pipettes after you're done. Okay, because what we don't want is any contamination of these liquids, as we'll see in a minute. A small amount of liquid can lead to quite a pronounced result in our test tubes. So once we've got a few drops of each one in a test tube, we now take the solution that we're going to be testing them with, and we add a few drops of this to those two test tubes. Okay, so take our dropper, a few drops in there, a few drops in there, and then we observe the results of our two tests. And hopefully what you can see here is very different results in those two test tubes. Okay? As I say, there are four sets of tests to do. I've just done one, okay? But you need to test substances A and B with, as it happens, silver nitrate, not barium chloride. E and F are tested with copper sulfate, and G and H are tested with lead nitrate. So before you start, write yourself a nice clear method to get you ready for writing methods in your investigation. And if there's anything that's not clear, then make sure you ask your teacher before you start.